everyone, welcome back to Hopper's Kitchen. Today's video, we are going to be making smash spuds with barbecue brisket. This menu is amazing, it's so easy to make, and it's absolutely delicious. So, first of all, you gotta grab your beef brisket, you gotta to season it, toss it in the oven, then barbecue it. And I'm going the simple route this video, we are microwaving our spuds. Stay tuned for the smashing. Okay, so here I have a beef brisket in the pan, lightly oil and season with salt, garlic, and pepper. Then we're gonna pop it in the oven at 200 degrees for about three hours. When that's finished, we're going to put it on the grill and get it nice and browned. Leave it on the grill for about 15 minutes on one side, and then you're gonna flip it on the other let it brown up nice real good so it'll be a beautiful brisket and then you can put barbecue sauce on it. All right, popping that brisket in the oven. I have the temp set actually at 220 and we're gonna leave it in there about two or three okay. hours. Step one on this video, I microwave our spud. It's very hot, ouch. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna treat it like a basic baked potato. I'm gonna slice the top. Let me show you guys down here. Okay, we are going to add some butter to our spud there right in the middle. Tablespoon of butter. Get that down in there. Okay. And we're gonna toss it over on its butt side. Okay, here's our spud. He is toasting in that melted butter. All right, so here we go. You wanna smash your spud. Using this side of this tool here makes it really nice and mashed potato-y. Smash that down, it looks great. Okay, now we're gonna take our meat. You can add pork, beef, or chicken. This has added barbecue sauce. Oh, that looks fantastic. Pork is easy to cook. You can put it in a crock pot all day and just let it sit there. Got a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Also, you could add some extra barbecue sauce to your meat there to top it off. I've got some sweet onion barbecue sauce, just a little bit. Okay. and some cheese on our potato. We're gonna add it before we add any more toppings. That's cheddar cheese. I also have some of my nacho cheese left from my can from another meal here. Extra cheesy and some sour cream. There we go. Shall we give it a taste test? I think it's taste test worthy. Looks great. So this is a smash spud you can do with um, beef brisket or pulled pork. You cook it all day in a crock pot. You can put your beef brisket in the oven for a couple hours low heat, and then you can put it on the grill for about an hour and let it get nice and crispy. I'm over here burning something else. <laughs> Sorry, kids. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, so here we go. Our smash spud. Shall we give it a taste test? Smells good. There's one thing in life that I will never get tired of, and that is potatoes. <laughs> I 
is terrific. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this video on Smashing Spuds. <laughs> and I think there will be some more boot scooting boogies in this video. So stay tuned for the next. 